This is a 1991 Chevrolet C1500 pickup truck. It's got 260,000 miles on it. I'm going to show you how to replace the catalytic converter. The reason why I'm replacing the catalytic converter is it's a little sluggish going up hills and it's a little underpowered. And that's a symptom of, of a bad catalytic Universal converter. Universal fit you can pick up. I got this one for 80 bucks at Pep Boys and the uh, other hardware that you'll need is only a few dollars more. So first thing we need to do is cut out the old catalytic converter or unbolt the old catalytic converter. Here we are underneath the truck. This is the old catalytic converter. And what we'll do is we'll undo those clamps. And then there should have been a clamp there. And I have a feeling that I'm probably gonna have to cut that, cut that seam or that joint right there. So as I kind of anticipated, it was rusted in there pretty bad. I ended up having to sawzall it out. Even though I was able to get the clamps off, uh, sawzall made quick work of cutting it out. So now what I'll do is we will go in and fit the new catalytic converter. With its little extension pipe and put him in where we took the old one out. All right, so now we're fitting the new catalytic converter, this little filler piece. And what I need to do is I need to cut off all this junk. I don't know if you can see that, all that junk right there. So he can slide over that pipe. So I'll cut that off and that'll get me close. And then I can take this pipe and adjust whatever I need to meet the Y pipe up, up in front. Now we have the new catalytic converter in. I was lucky I didn't have to trim. I didn't have to trim this guy at all. My cutout and my measurements were right, so no trimming there. So now all I have to do is put the clamps on. And those are just uh, two and a half inch. and a half inch exhaust clamps. Now we are completely done. We've got the clamps tightened up, new catalytic converter on, heat shield is faced up. Doesn't matter which direction the airflow goes, it's universal. We got our new clamp on. And it's pretty easy. It only took me 45 minutes from start to finish that's picking up parts. We're not picking up parts, but grabbing the tools, cutting stuff out, putting it back to the eye.